Jeder kommt her und klatscht. Ja, gut. Ich sing meinen Song, wenn du hörst den Gang, wenn Tanz in den Twist, bist du mit der Best. The Residents. Already in the 70s, they produced albums full of sarcastic interpretations of top 40 hit songs, for instance on the Third Reich and Roll. That album was dedicated to the thousands of little power-mad minds in the music business. We asked Hardy Fox if perhaps you can compare the financial world to the music industry and if the financial crisis may have been caused by the same sort of little power-mad minds. Uh, I think in the financial business, I, I, I think the key word is really greed. Uh, I, I think people are just trying to make as much money as possible and they're not thinking of the consequences. That, um, and I, I think the attitude is that it'll work out and probably it will work out, but you know, it might take, take many years and some people are going to end up very wealthy as a result of it and some people are going to end up very poor. Could you say that um, the residents or the crypto corporations were affected in any way by the recent financial crisis? Um, <clears throat> I would say no at this point, but I expect that it, that it will happen. Uh, I think everyone will be affected eventually. The residents or the crypto corporation, either one, are dealing on high enough financial level where they're impacted at first, mm -hmm. but it trickles down. Mm -hmm. So, and, and what will the effect be? Will it be harder to produce albums or, or shows? I don't know that I can answer that right now. You'll have to get back to me later. <laughs> Maybe uh, when I'm in the gutter somewhere, uh, <laughs> collecting change. The Bunny Boy is the resident's most recent project. It is about a former cryptic corporation employee called Bunny, whose brother Harvey has disappeared on the Greek island of Petmos. To get information on Harvey's disappearance, Bunny publishes videos on YouTube on the internet. So these are the postcards that started it all. See, it comes from the island of Patmos in Greece and says, this is it. Patmos is a really special place. I know I will find what I am looking for. I, I feel it in the air. Okay, so here's the deal. My brother Harvey is missing. He just, just disappeared. I don't have many clues about what happened, but, but this is one right here, on this answering machine. Listen. Hello? Hello? Is anybody there? Please pick up if you're there. Anybody? Anybody? There's been an accident. We're in Greece. There's, there's been an accident. Hey, does any of this mean anything to anybody out there? Huh? I keep making these videos. But nobody sends anything back to me. Is anybody out there? Huh? 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 The Bunny Boy is a project which comprises more than just a CD. There's also the internet, the YouTube films. Yes. Uh, could you comment uh, on, on the relation between the two? I mean, the, the, what we see at, at YouTube, and I get one every so so many days in my mailbox, which is great. But they're not regular clips, so to speak. No. No, what, what happened is that the residents are very much, you know, they're, they don't think of themselves as a band. They think of themselves as like media people. So they like to use media and they work a lot with music because music actually produces a, a product that you can put in stores. And so yeah. it's very easy to go that way, but that's not really how they see themselves. And in this situation, they've really wanting to expand more on, on the story and on narrative uh, in their projects. And they've been doing this for a while. But the thing is that the public hasn't really bought into that too well. They, they haven't really gone for that direction. Uh, and so they thought, well, maybe the thing to do is to take the narrative back out of the album and put it on the internet. 
and just have the album be music. But the thing is that the, <laughs> the narrative side of it didn't have any music. Uh, there were no songs in it. So the album turns out to not to be music that is not in the internet series and the internet series is not on the album. And so they've become two like different approaches, two media approaches to a similar way of thinking. So the album actually is like a, inspired by the internet series. And then that turned into the live show, which is like combining everything. One of the things that is interesting, and particularly in the live thing, is that um, what's happened is that you know you you, you know the videos that are running, and um, the videos carry a an a, a email address, yeah. and so like there's just like floods of emails coming into Bunny, and Bunny has personally answered every email that has come in, and so there are lots of clues that are coming in through emails, and those are being published in in the residents forum and. So people are also compiling these these answers to get more data about more details about what's going on. And with the tour, we had the tour in the United States, and uh, the uh, content of that tour, the narrative aspect of that tour, evolved over time so that the tour in uh, for Europe is different from the one. <laughs> that was in the States because more time has passed. So he has more information on the tour in Europe. And uh, if the show continues as, as we expect it to uh, into 2009, the story will even evolve more. And part of the evolution of it, and the part I think is, is really cool for the residents is that they're, um, they're using feedback from this email address to help drive the story. It's not like all written out in advance. They're collecting ideas from uh, from the internet and from people's uh, suggestions and ideas because sometimes people have really cool ideas about how, where the story could go. So it's like, why not change it? So that might be the residence form of karaoke. <laughs> could be, could be modern karaoke. Modern karaoke. <laughs> 